Hey guys and welcome back to another squad builder challenge. Today we are doing on one to watch and Morgan Sampson. So as you can see he is a first owner so I did pack him very recently, haven't played a game with him yet. And obviously he's this transfer card to Marseille. So in case you are new around here and you don't know what the rules are, basically I have to randomize my formation. I know I don't use a camera but I don't actually look at the screen. So I get a randomized formation. I have to use a minimum of three different leagues I can only have three players from the same league and I open one pack to get a second player. So, like always, let's get into the packs. Open one premium gold pack and we'll see what person we get. So as you can see, there are promo packs around, but I'm not gonna open them. I'm gonna stick to the rules. What I normally do on that is open just one premium gold pack and we'll see if we get anyone decent. So it's a non-rate, so it's not a good start at all. But it's Beltman. Beltman's not actually that bad of a player, if I'm being honest. Uh, we get Fazio from Roma. Not exactly the best of players. And we get this guy from Club Bruce. Do I get any duplicates? Don't think I have. No, I haven't. So I'm going to choose Beltman. So let's get Beltman and let's put him into the squad. So as I always say, guys, you have to trust me that I'm not looking at the formation. I do do it randomly, so I don't look at all. So... So as you can see, we are randomizing and we will stop in three, two, one. And we're on the formation that we started with. Okay, so the four, three, three, third variation. Okay, so there's no point in randomizing then because like I said, we stayed where we were. So where do we start with this league then? So straight away, let's just see what Dutch players have got in my team. I got Jezra Williams, I got Van Anholt. We just see what players have got overall. So I got De Vries, got Van Persie, Promise, Bruma, the Pie could come in as well. Van Dyke could come in. Okay, so I got a few options that I can go with. So I think what I might go with is left back. Let's go left back. Let's go with Van Anholt. I am tried him before. Let's put Van Anholt there. Let me see if this works a second. Cause obviously I've got to get an no, I don't, I don't actually get another league in here. So let me just have a look at what French right backs we've got. We've got no French right backs at all, which is pretty strange. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go to here. Have I got any French from the BPL maybe? Let's see what French centre backs we've got. So we've got the Porte Sacco and Titi and Biwa. It would be nice if we had one obviously from the Dutch league, but. That's not possible. So what I'm going to do is go into there. Let's get another Dutch one in. And I think I'm going to go with this guy any good. This guy doesn't seem that bad. So I'll put him in and get a nice strong link to a Veltman there. Have I got any Dutch goalkeepers? I haven't. So let me just a quick look on the transfer mark. Oh, that's the concept. See what is around actually. Maybe if I crawl in, get a nice strong link. So once again, we're going to have to go on the transfer market for this one. We're going to have to get a French player in. Let's see concept first. Normal card is actually not that bad. So let's see if we can find him on the transfer market. 550, I'll do. 550 is fine. So nice strong link there to Santon. And where are we going to go here? So we've got all of our three leagues in already. So let me just have a quick look. See if we've got any other Dutch players in our midfield position. Now I have used Van Ginkel before, so I'm going to put Van Ginkel in. And then and what I want is any French midfielder. Alright, so I'm going from the Premiership. Is there any decent... What am I looking for? Am I looking for a camera centre midfield? Centre midfielder. So let me have a quick look in the Premiership. See what is around. I don't want to like some kind of DNA. Well, Pogba, I'd love to have Pogba, but I can't afford him. So let's put Imbula in instead. I do like Imbula. I've had him before on one of my other squad builders and he's actually pretty decent so let's get him in for 700 so that's what the team is looking like at the moment i would like to see if i can get another league in here so i'm gonna go on the right wing obviously i'm gonna have to have french again unfortunately viviani could be good fekia could be decent but i did see in my club just now that i've got that dembele which i wouldn't mind trying this dembele out i haven't tried him before so Let's put Dembele in there. Let's see if I've got a French Bundesliga. That's what I want. 
Look, I would have no. Is there actually any in there or no? There's Anthony Modesk. I do actually quite like Anthony Modesk. I haven't played him on here, but in real life, I do actually quite like him. Let's see how much this card is going for. No results found for that one. So let's see if it got another one in here or not. Let's see if it's got an 80 rated card. Just go and look for that one. See what it's like. Uh, yeah, fine. Let's take this one. Anthony Modesk, not a bad player. He looks all right, nothing special. If I could get a Dutch Dutch left winger from the Bundesliga, that would be ideal, but I doubt there are any. So, concept, no, I didn't think so. So, let's see what Cologne players are actually in here. They've got anyone decent, so they haven't got a left winger, and they've got a left midfielder. Frankfurt looks okay, but I'd rather someone decent, if I'm being honest. So, let's just go there, and let's think I'll just go with another Dutch player. Let's go to Pi. So that is what the team is looking like. But what I might do in the next episode is do a minimum of four players from the same nation. So get another three nations in here instead of like two what I've got at the moment. That could work a little bit better. Let me know what you think anyway. If you think I should do a minimum of three or four from the same nation, let me know what you think in the comment section. If you think I should just do three or four players from the same nation so at least I get three different nations in here at least then to make it a bit more challenging yeah let me know in the comments whether you think I should do that or not so like always I'll just fill the bench up now pretty quickly but yeah that is the bench all done so let's just jump into a game and see what our opponent looks like so we got an opponent for this episode and that is a fucking sick team Griezmann up front with Eden Hazard we got Costa and that Dembele, Isco, Bailly, one to watch, Smalling, fuck me, that is an amazing team. Alright, so we've got a massive challenge on our hands. Let's see if we can win this. This is going to be a very interesting game. Sanson on the board, going all the way. I said Sanson, if we get it onto your right foot, comes up to Mbula and unfortunately gets a tackle in. And he made a mistake, gives it to Dembele, cuts inside, let's try and get it out to Depay. Depay should have scored, but it's fallen straight to Mbula, and we are 1-0 up. Not the best of goals, but decent play, and yeah, Depay should have scored. It's a good play with Dembele, nice little through ball. Depay should have scored, but it falls to Mbula, who starts it in 1-0 up, and yeah, this is looking good. Go one two to get the pie on the ball. So get that through. It's come to Mbula. No, it's not. It's Modest. Anthony Modest makes it 2 0 with a pretty good finish. I gotta give him that. It wasn't the easiest to finishes. But that was great play by the pie again. Just cuts inside and good ball to Modest. And Modest just strikes it in to make it 2 0 up. So go to Modest again. Going to Anthony Modest again, and he smashes it in to make it 3 0. Fuck me. Anthony Modest, this team is playing awesome. If you look at his team at the start of the game, you look at my team, he should be smashing me. He's made a mistake to go to Empula. Anthony Modest. Get out of the stance and just so you can have a shot. Wasn't a bad effort either, to be honest. So as we're at half time, we are 3 0 up. Had six shots, five on target, 53% possession. He's had one shot, one on target. And to be honest, this has not been the hardest of games. I was expecting this to be pretty solid. Like I said, you've seen this, this team at the start of the game, and it was actually unbelievable that team he's got. But we're playing really well. We're actually taking our chances for once. And yeah, 3 0 up, looking good so far. That's a great ball to get Den Belly in. If someone could get in the box, that'd be great. No one's in the box. So Sanson, great flick into Mbula and just wide. I thought that was going to sneak in for a second. It's a nice play by Modest. Let's get that in. Get back to Mbula. So out to Depay. Depay finished that with your right foot. And it's a decent save by Butlin. But that should have been 4 0. That's a great play. Get Anthony Modest in again. Finish down the desk, make a 4 0, and there is this hat trick. Anthony Modest is sick on here. I normally sell my squad after I didn't want to score a bill of challenges, but 
I think Modesto's not going to anywhere. I think I've got to keep him. I guess he's going to rage quit, right? There we are, and we get the rage quit. Fantastic. So as you see on the screen, guys, that is the fair ratings. Seeing Ant Modesto got a straight 10. He got a hat trick on here. The fight got 8.9 in Bula. Samson played really well. It was actually a little bit weary because. I thought maybe I should have changed this card from a CDM to a set in the middle, but it a little bit better, but he actually had a solid game, he played really well, and yeah, everyone just played really well, it's the first time in a while that everyone just clicked straight away, so as you can see, 4-0 win, going to the stats, let's see what the stats are saying, 2 out of 10 shots, 10 on target, 60 percent possession, yeah, 1 shot, 1 on target, and like I said, if you look at his team, let me go on to his team again, look at that team. Griezmann, Hazard, Carrasco, Dembele, Costa, Isco, DeMarco, Smolin, Bailly, Bellerin, Butland. And most of them are all special cards, so I actually think I've done pretty well there. So right, before we leave today, I'm going to reward myself with a promo pack. So let's go into a promo pack, let's open one pack, just to celebrate. I'm going to do a 25k one, only because I find them a little bit better than 45k, I don't know why, but they seem to be a little bit better. So let's have a look, so it's not a walkout, is it anyone decent? Centre back, and it's the freeze, or we already got, so a bit of a waste to be honest. The kill do get with Maldon, it was pretty shit if I'm being honest. Uh, stones as well, it's not bad. So that wasn't exactly the best of packs to end with, but overall I'm happy with how the actual episode all went. So guys, if you do want to buy some players to do some more squad builder challenges around, then let me know in the comments any special cards. Loans are not too expensive because I don't play this game that much anymore. You know I am in Division 2 I think at the moment. Yeah, I'm in Division 2 at the moment but I've stopped playing this game for a while. I don't know why but let me just have a quick look. See what special cards are actually on the market. That default actually doesn't look bad. You know what? I'm going to buy that default. So you can look forward to that next time guys. I say if you do see someone that you want me to do around then let me know and I'll have a little look for them. Like, with people like Jesus and that, I can't really afford at the moment. Even though I would love to get it, but I just can't afford him. So like I said, guys, just have a little look at my transfer market. If some players are around... Oh, that Modesto actually looks pretty good. Yeah, if some players are around maybe 50k at the very most. That swine side looks good as well. Yeah, i say probably about 50k at the most, then I'll buy one. But if it's over 50k, then... I will not buy it, just letting you know now I won't buy it at all. So yeah, have a little look on the transfer markets and I will see what players are around. And if you want me to get one, then let me know and I'll do a squad builder challenge around it. But anyway guys, like I said, that is going to be it for today's episode. So if you did enjoy it, then hit that like button. If you are new around here, hit the subscribe button, it would be much appreciated. And like always, if you did enjoy the episode, hit that dislike button, let me know why in the comments so I can improve on other videos. I'll catch you all in the next squad builder. See ya.